Our prayers this morning have been provided by uh, Jennifer Sell. So let's pray. When I say Jesus, Lord of life, if you would respond with the words, fill us with your love. Lord, whatever the weather, whether the sun is shining or if it is overcast or threatening to be cold or rainy, or if we are feeling happy or maybe downcast, we are minded to praise you or to come to you in prayer. Jesus, Lord of life, fill us with your love. God so loved the world that he gave his only son, so that whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have eternal life. Thank you, Jesus, for your sacrifice upon the cross for each one of us, for taking upon your shoulders the sins of the whole world. Help us to love one another as you have loved us. Jesus, Lord of life, fill us with your love. Lord Jesus, bring peace to our families, to our neighbours and to all in our church family. We pray for all who are in trouble, in need or in sickness. We pray for those nations who are at war or where there is civil unrest. We also pray for all fleeing persecution and the homeless. Jesus said, come to me and I will give you rest. Jesus, Lord of life, fill us with your love. We pray for all who have died in the last year and for those who have been patiently waiting for treatment. We remember Audrey Warren, Bill Hood and their families and the families of all those mourning the loss of loved ones at this time. We also pray for the successful rollout of the vaccine worldwide. Jesus said, I am the resurrection and the life. Whoever believes in me will live even though he dies and everyone who lives by believing in me will never die. Glorious God and Lord of all life, fill us with your love and sustain us by your indwelling spirit. Amen. So shall we join together on this glorious Easter day as we remember the resurrection of our Lord and Saviour Jesus Christ. Let us join together in the words of the prayer that he taught us. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power and the glory, for ever and ever. Amen. Our next hymn is the hymn, See What a Morning. 